What's up guys, it's Awana Turtle and today we are doing another Pokemon opening. We are going to do more Ultra Shiny GX in the form of the Korean box. Uh, really excited about this, um, quite enjoying this, starting to enjoy this more. Uh, the fact that you get three SRs or two of the boxes we've gotten open had two SRs while one had two, uh, but nonetheless, still really fun to open it. Um, well, I put the Japanese one a little bit higher uh, for the price point where these are much more affordable. I've definitely been uh, really enjoying the opening. So, um, yeah, let's get into this, guys. Uh, if you haven't seen Friday's video, definitely go check it out where we do announce another giveaway for this Squirtle Magic Carp uh, Mini Tin. And uh, so if you haven't or if you're not already entered, make sure you go check out that video and uh, make sure you enter the giveaway. Uh, with all that being said, let's get into some more Ultra Shiny GX action. We have to do this first. <laughs> Will this be the day? Alright, we got a fire, or <laughs> fire, fighting energy, escape rope. Gloom, Acerola, Hoot Hoot, Tangela, Dewpiter, Inke, Ralts, ooh, Escape Rope Reverse, not bad, and then a Weavile. So the hunt will continue. And let's get into this Ultra Shiny box. Uh, in the last video, I kind of talked about the warpage, and uh, just a quick update on that, although I think I put it in some of the comments, is that uh, while the warpage is really bad, uh, the same thing happens on the Japanese set as well. And even uh, while I'm not crazy about top loaders, uh, these ones definitely make sure you put in top loader just because the yeah the warpage is on, it's on another level. All right, let's do this pack number one. Let's see, make sure, let's go for that three full arts. And oh, guys, recently pulled a very monster card from one of these boxes and. Uh, yeah, it was the big boy, that Charizard. So ho hopefully we can get another one. That would be awesome. Um, ooh, okay. A Naganadal GX to start the opening. Uh, let's see. However, I would be just as happy with... Actually, uh, I'm not sure we pulled any full art trainers yet. Um, although, and I do think that those take the SR slot. So definitely would like to see a Cynthia or Guzma. And... Uh, gold rare as well. To be honest, I'm not entirely sure if those are in this set just because we have yet to see it. So we got a Quagsire, a Morotom, Raikou, and then a Rushy Ram. And we did give away three of them. Uh, two on this channel, one on Instagram. And uh, maybe we'll do that, do another one uh, as uh, un <coughs> excuse me, Unbroken Bonds gets closer and closer. Really excited about that set. It's going to open a bunch of stuff. Hoping for many mucks. Ooh, Guzma reverse, or not reverse, everything is reverse. Pseudobudo, Lowland Executor, Altaria Hollow, and then a Guzzlord. So, yeah, in case you guys, if this is your first time seeing the Korean set, every single card is kind of like reverse, where so that means the energies look awesome, and uh, all the other cards, almost they look borderline fake, <laughs> but they're very real. But, uh, like, it wasn't just a one time set printing in Korean. So we have a Fighting Energy, nice. Ralts, I don't remember your name. Alola Marowak, Beast Ring, very nice. A Pheromosa, and then, ooh, Frogadier for our first, um, first SR. One thing I'm not sure about is, so, for all the Japanese cards, you can get them PSA graded, and while I haven't started doing gradings yet, I'm considering doing it in the near future. Uh, it's pretty expensive though. And when it comes to that, that shiny Charizard hit, like, I don't care if it's Korean, like, I wanna, that thing, that thing, I'm really happy to have pulled that. So, and I would consider getting it graded, but I'm not sure if they grade Korean cards. Um, all right, so let's see, we got, can't remember your name. Is this the Terminator? Ultra Space, I'm pretty sure, Zygarde, and then a Xerneas. Uh, I think in a recent uh, recent video I called him Zergatry for some reason. Someone had a brain fart. That's the thing about these uh, Ultra Shiny GX is 
uh, while it's nice that the kind of like the ratios are kind of very consistent um, there's like so many things to collect so on the Japanese side you have just the the cards which probably doesn't take too long to get all those but then you have like the hollows and the GX's and then there's like the shatter rare which I guess is like very similar to the reverse and then all the SR's <laughs> which is the shiny variants of the non-GX cards and the SSRs which is the shiny GX's and then you have the full art trainers you have the gold cards so I imagine to complete a master set especially if you don't buy any singles that would take forever probably like I don't know hundreds of boxes but so far we have one GX and one SR all right let's go into this one we got a Sneasel, Wimpod, Riolu, Metal Energy, Poipol, Fairy Charm for the Ultra Beast, Macargo, I believe that's smooth over, Fan Rotom, ooh, Zekrom, where's your, where's your uh, Pikachu friend, and then a Lycanroc, I believe this is the one that has the ability to basically, uh, you can swap your opponent's active Pokemon with someone from their bench, and, ah, so, um, we do have some awesome hits awesome cards coming in for as far as some stuff that i recently acquired so i look forward to getting that and uh maybe we'll start like a different series um playing with rounds with some different names i'm going thinking of from the vault right now kind of a ode to some match the gathering stuff but essentially to start showing off some of my uh rare stuff in my collection uh, especially when it comes to revolves around psa grading so I uh, expect to see that probably in the near future. So we have a, <clears throat> a Manaphy Hollow and then a so or Dusk Mane Necrozma. I keep thinking he's Sogaleo on first glance. Uh, this is by far my favorite Necrozma card. All right, we're chugging right through. We got a Sableye, Pachirisu, Riolu, Fairy Energy, Rockruff, Counter Energy, I think, Pseudo Wudo, a Flash Rotom. A Lolan Ninetales, and then a. Uh, is that the energy that can count as two for any any color as long as it's you have a certain number of stage twos? All right, so uh, as we kind of like wind down this month and, and get into April. Uh, a lot of stuff is going to be happening so really excited about that we're gonna have some detective Pikachu stuff coming out and then in May unbroken bond so very exciting I feel like it's a very exciting time to be in the Pokemon involved in the Pokemon TCG just a lot of cool products coming out um, GG end for the Japanese set as well excited to get a hands on a box of that to open for you guys GG end I that name I just find so funny All right, so uh, we've been a bit of a dry spell as far as this box goes. Uh, and I do feel like that triple three SRs is not guaranteed. Uh, where, Cause our, that's how our first box was only had two. Um, so I'm starting to get a little nervous. Although sometimes when, when you're, ooh, okay. So Viper shiny. And yeah, that's definitely a shiny. You can, you can tell just cause it's textured and uh, I could be wrong, but he doesn't look that different. <laughs> And yeah, when we were, when things were getting really, really antsy, that's when that, that uh, beautiful shining Charizard appeared. So maybe a little, little on edge sometimes pays off. All right, we got a Whooper, a Ivysaur, Ralts, Fire Energy, Cubone. Can't ever remember their names. Uh, Mo Rotom, Copycat. Hydreigon, and then a Blaziken. Oh, and I'm not sure when um, when Sword and Shield comes out. Maybe it's still a while because it was only I feel like it was only recently announced. But uh, yeah, the new gen coming out. Um, to be honest, I'm not sure from when they release the game how quickly they end up in the cards. Uh, but that will be that will be a very exciting time. All right, we got a Leaf Energy. Uh, Cosmoem, I think this is the counter energy. Pseudowoodo, I feel like we get a lot of Pseudowoodos. Flash Rotom, ooh, Lucario. We got a shiny of him not too long ago. And then a Zergatry. And uh, oh, so 
I think what I'm going to do when we do hit 200 subscribers, it's still a little bit of ways off, but uh, I think we're getting close to where we can start considering. I think what I'm going to do is open another ultra shiny Japanese box and this time give away two packs as opposed to one, basically doubling those chances of getting one of the SR or SSRs. So really excited about that. So um, yeah, get or look forward to when we hit that 200 sub mark. Uh, we're still again. Oh, okay. So yeah, it's not very different. It's just seemed like very subtle difference. And so let's see. We got a Celesteela and this should be some... Ooh. Oh, what? Zorark. Zorark is a cool card, but... Oh, man. Does that mean we're not going to get three... Three SRs? This has to be the SSR, guys. That would be the ultimate disappointment if there's no SSRs in here. Uh... I am going to be very upset. Maybe this will be the last Korean box we open. Um, let's find out. While I'm pretty confident, I'm not that confident. <laughs> All right, we got a Rock Rough, Magnemite, Beast Ring, Guzma Nice, Pseudo Wudo, Baby Buzzwall, and boom! Ooh, yes. Okay, so we didn't get. Super disappointed, and we got a Lycanroc GX, so this is the opposite one, uh, and all right, all right, so we didn't, we didn't get totally gypped, uh, although, um, yeah, it, in, in some, in some respects, I do like the, the, the regular, the SR shinies a little bit, sometimes better than the GX ones. So here's our SSR card. Um, <clears throat> so in summary, we have a Naganadal GX, Lycanroc GX, a Zorark, which is a pretty good card. And then for our SRs, we have a uh, Frogadier plus a Viper. And lastly, our SSR is that Lycanroc, excuse me. So, um, yeah, okay, we got, we got shorted an SR, but... Uh, Still a pretty good opening and uh, as always guys if you did enjoy this content and want to see more of this ultra shiny stuff Let me know by hitting that like button and let me know in a comment as well what you're looking forward to the most Is it Detective Pikachu? Is it Unbroken Bonds? Um, and kind of again what you want to see more of uh, just so I can try to take that information and see what I can find uh, Other than that guys, I'm a Wanda Turtle and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace